Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name is CKT Chaotic. Today I'll be reading Marry My Husband, episode 52. Due to Webtoon's new policy, I do have to blur 50% of this episode with the cat logo, so sorry if you guys want to read along with me. It's available on webtoons.com. I do have this on my private video where all the logo and everything and also gain early access to all my reads. Not for this month, but for next month. Uh, it's available on patreon.com slash CKT Chaotic. Let's go ahead and get started. Mm. <laughs> okay saying all of it but i have to ding no did he mention anything important oh yeah i forgot uh, click stop a mysterious person taking pictures hmm marry my husband episode 52 why does he keep sleeping here when he lives next door Excuse me, ji -yuk. It's time to get up. I have to go to work. Oh! Let me hold you in my arms. Uh -oh. For a few minutes. Unlike you, I'm a salaried employee, which means I'll get in trouble if I'm late. I'll give you a ride and make sure you arrive on time. But there will be a lot of traffic. We have about 10 minutes to spare. Ring. Oh. Well, I think you're going to use up those 10 minutes on your phone call. Yes, Mr. O. I'm sorry, sir. Did you get a chance to read the article? The article? Please check your email right away. What's going on? Grandson of UNK chairman to marry subordinate employee? The woman in question is a UNK employee who has been seeing the... who have who was seen visiting the chairman's office. This is modern day Cinderella story. She's probably a digger, a go digger. She's planning to turn her life around by, is that woman who dumped her fiance for? I'm sorry. Someone at the secretary's office must have leaked this photo. Are you right? <laughs> yes, I'm fine. The press conference made me realize I don't need to pay attention to what other people say behind my back. I'm going to get ready now. I have to get. Uh, I have to get to work. You're going to the. You're going to go to the office. I feel like you should take the day off today. No matter what anyone says about me, I have a job to get to. <laughs> it's not like I'm going to quit. I'm going to go wash up now. Thank you for the ride. I'll call you when I get off of work. G1. I'm sorry for once again making your life difficult. I know that you don't want to get married in this lifetime. I also don't want to see you struggle because of my family ties either. So he knows. Jiuk. In my previous life and my current one, your happiness is what matters the most to me. So if you wish to break things off with me, feel free to do so at any time. Uh, break things off with him? I'll be talking to Mr. O about issuing a correction. I'll handle, I'll handle the aftermath, so don't worry. So, so you want me to leave you and be happy on my own? Why do you get to decide that? Come with me. I want you to walk with walk me to my desk today. Uh. Oh. Floor three. Oh. Hey, you saw the news, right? I heard she's dating him despite all the bad rumors because she wants his money. Apparently the chairman was going to give her a promotion. I can't believe an ordinary employee is going to marry the chairman's grandson. She got some skills. I feel bad for the guy. He got fooled by a woman who's after his money. Uh, those jerks. Uh, uh. Excuse me. We need to get off here. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, right. Although we're not married yet, we're serious about each other. So please don't mischaracterize our relationship. Ooh. <laughs> I feel much better. What was that just now? Oh, 
that thing I just said. I, it means we'll always be together. So from now on, please don't tell me to break things off with you. You hurt my feelings. All right. Thank you, Juwon. Ji Hyuk Yoo, the grandson of the chairman of UNK Group, made headlines today when MBS News reported that he is planning to marry a female employee who works at UNK Group. Ji Hyuk Yoo, the grandson of the chairman of UNK, taking into account UNK assets, which are estimated to be worth billions of wands, as well as their stocks and real estate. Many calling this a modern day Cinderella story. Billions of wands? Real estate? Stocks? Huh? This can't be happening! She wants going to marry into a family like that? Oh no, no, no! There's no way! This isn't fair! What the hell is wrong with her? Call the guards! <laughs> no, no! I can't let you want to marry into a rich family like that! What can I do to ruin her life? What can I do to? <gasps> I need to use a phone. I need to call him. Who? Um. Oh, are you feeling better? Do you mind if I use the phone? I want to make a quick call, f phone call to my family. How many calls have you made this month? None. This is my first time. Fine. I'll make an exception. You have five minutes. Thank you so much! Ring. Dad? It's me, Suman. I called because I have something to tell you. I told you to not call me. I don't want anything from you, Dad. Are you still living with that woman? Oops. Why are you asking me that? To share some good news with her. I'm calling to tell her that her only daughter... <laughs> is marrying into one of the wealthiest family in the country. I don't know much about, you know, Jiwon and of course Suman's dad and Jiwon's mom, but I don't know if they're like gold diggers or like money hungry type of people, but if they interact, like if they, you know, become extremely happy and want to come back to Jiwon's life because of this news, then yeah, they are uh, money-hungry biatch. <laughs> but wow, Suman always finds a way. Like who would thought that she would call up her dad to stir up this pot? You know, like, oh, Suman is back. But I kind of knew she was going to come up sooner or later. Like you guys even warned me like, hey, the next few episodes, she is back, and I'm just like, oh gosh, what is, what is it now, right? Can Jiwon and Jiyuk just catch a break? But, oh, oh. All right, guys, if you guys enjoy my webtoon reaction slash reading style, feel free to subscribe, leave a thumbs up, drop some comments, and I'll catch you guys next time. Bye!